Moroccan Jews have dispersed in the last century with large portions in France, Canada and Israel, although a relatively large amount still live in Morocco. Their traditions are unique, but of the most distinct is the Mimuna, which accompanies the Pesach festivities. The Mimuna is a celebration of the last day of Pesach. That night, families, mainly from Morocco, Tunisia, Algeria and across North Africa, even as far as Turkey, will set a table filled with food and keep their doors open until early morning, so that everyone can come. There are many opinions regarding the date of origin of the holiday, but Professor Rachel Sharabi found it to have originated in the 18th century and reignited within the Israeli context in 1965. In Nissan, the Israelites were redeemed, and in Nissan, they will be redeemed in the future. This was a saying known amongst all Jews. Yet, another Passover had come and gone, and the rabbis were afraid that the Jews would lose hope. Hence, a post-holiday celebration, opening up the hope for the Messiah to come in the following year. The hosts traditionally bless their guests. Tirvachu l'tza'adul am hada, zukan ana vel am zi be'eret Yisrael. Meaning, may you be blessed with wealth and go forth this year and next year in the land of Israel. Today, it has been adapted to Tirvachu v'tza'adu, earn and eat. In fact, some Hasidic sects have adopted and amended this custom celebrating the Sudat Mashiach, or Messiah banquet. The food tends to be sweet, as if to wish upon the guests sweetness in other areas of their lives. Foods are generally milk, nuts, honey, and lots of vegetables. After all, it is springtime. This holiday is uniquely tied to the Muslim neighbors of the Jews. Jews would give their sourdough base to the Muslims throughout Pesach. Jews would also not eat any dairy throughout the holidays eight days, as no Jews owned cows and therefore could not watch over the milking process to avoid chametz flying in. So the Muslims brought the milk items and the sourdough base and together they shared the food and conversation. The one chametz item and the iconic mimuna food is the mufleta. It is a thin sourdough prepared a couple of minutes before the celebrations. To add to the sweetness of the day, it is customary to serve it with honey, jam or chocolate spread. Some of the opinions regarding its history relate it to a celebration of the beginning of the new cycle in agriculture. This may relate to the custom to take the following day off and enjoy nature, parks, natural reserves and springs. There, they would set up picnics for the whole family. While Moroccan Jews living in Israel brought the Mimuna tradition with them, it was in 1965 that the celebrations became more large scale. The first organization run Mimuna took place in Lod where 300 people gathered. Since then, almost every major city in Israel has a Mimuna celebration for the general public, where politicians of various kinds also take part. The Mimuna celebrations are now a familiar part of Pesach in Israel.